also good news <clears throat> I'm not banned from riding a bus the Pensacola um ECOT transit so the lady finally got to me she said she just got off vacation yesterday and um so I'm well she, she said that the only way I would get like banned from riding a bus or something like that is if there was like a physical altercation or something like that you know but that um I mean, what, what was I supposed to think? Nobody told me anything. And the bus driver took Alex's lies and kicked me off the bus. And the police said, well, they, they just don't want you to ride the bus. Or whatever they said, you know. So I'm on the Greyhound right now, headed back to Pensacola. Looks like it's going to rain. Um, so the bus is um this greyhound bus you know they never leave exactly on time you know so the fact that they never leave on time and they usually drive kind of slow so um i don't think i'll be able to make that transit bus you know, in order to try to get downtown. So, you know, the money that a guy helped me out with last night, I, I mean, I'm trying what I could, you know, if the bus driver can make it on time, I don't think he will. Um, if I can get to the, um, which I don't think I'll be able to make it. I think I'd probably be then just missed that transit bus, the last one to take me to the ECAP bus station and then go downtown. And this evening, I won't be able to make it to my storage unit and get my sleeping bag, but I'll go tomorrow and uh, get my sleeping bag. And uh, my sleeping bag and my new little chair that I got before I left you know, so things really didn't work out in Mobile, but I'm glad to not be banned from riding the bus because I really missed the beach. I really missed the beach. And I had my earphones in, so I apologize for any outside noise or sound or whatever, you know. I see Louisiana license plate. And they got some nice houses, too. Um, you so, look at that <laughs> little bus ride. Uh, <clears throat> yeah, so it's, here's a little fun right here Mobile, Alabama. No, I don't Farewell. Have one, First, it was some nice houses, now it's some um, whatever buildings. Excuse me. I just missed the nice house. What did you? It looks like we're downtown. No, uh, no, no, are no. we? Yeah, this is downtown. Towards downtown, I think. Yeah. Towards downtown Mobile, Alabama. Um. So. <clears throat> yeah, ooh, it looked like it was about to storm. <clears throat> yeah, as I said, the um that homeless guy he contaminated he contaminated that homeless perp contaminated my um rainy day sleep spot where there's the shelter or whatever. I mean, the little spot um, where I can have a little shelter by an abandoned building to protect me from the rain, you know? 
<clears throat> um, so, like, I guess we'll see. I don't know. Some people say that what Alex keeps doing is is just street theater or whatever. That's not a bad grocery store right there. Greer's. That's their local grocery store. Like, it's like New Orleans, they have Rouse's and Robert's. That's the library right there. Uh, but there's another, the big library right there. Or, and yep, and this is, this has been downtown. Uh, hmm. So now this looks familiar because <laughs> it wasn't familiar before. I mean, it didn't seem familiar. That's that budget in hotel that they, um, they seem like they're prejudiced and they don't want me to, they're like $50 a night and they never allow me there for some reason. Look at this. This is Chamber of Commerce right here. Uh, so, uh, <clears throat> um, so they, they have Carnival, similar to New Orleans Mardi Gras, over here too, you know, looks like up there, look like some traffic, um, so, um, I'm feeling a little more at ease, you know. <clears throat> um, so I just wanted to show y'all this, um, this little ride downtown. Um, and see, some more hotels. You know, of course, Holiday Inn. You can't afford that, you know. And the hotel I was staying at down the street that way. I don't know. Not that street. It's the next one. There wasn't either one. You know. Um, so, <clears throat> this is downtown where <clears throat> I have walked up this street a lot. Further that way, is where that park is. I've done videos about the park. I, I mean, I've done videos at the park. It's far, that further down that way. So now we're going under the tunnel. I, I love riding under the tunnel. <laughs> it's fun riding under the tunnel. Oh yeah, that's that tunnel. Cool. So... I don't know how far or how much we ride under the tunnel before we get to the state of Florida. I don't know. It's like I think when the moment, I could be wrong, but I think it seems like the moment you're in Florida, you, you're automatically like, I could be wrong, but it's like Pensacola is so close to the border, you know. It looked like yeah, the traffic kind of slowed down. So me riding, I kind of learned something new. <laughs> so I experienced that little area. So now I know that next time I ride something like this, coming between Mobile and Pensacola, it's going to seem familiar or be familiar, you know? And after this tunnel, I think it's going to be some, I mean, like a body of water or something like that, you know. So, the tunnel we ride under, I'm wondering if that's what kind of what the park is and stuff where we hang out. Nope, it ain't because, um... There's the body of water. I think the park is that way because um, I see the same buildings. I think that body of water might be that way, you know. So I'm done with this little tour. <laughs>
We're giving y'all a little downtown Mobile, Alabama tour. Ooh, it's a pretty little lake over there. Um, this is the body of water. But, I mean, not by the park, but it's a different body of water. Uh, watch this. Yeah, here it is. Yeah. <laughs> Looks like swamp water. So, I'm gonna see y'all later. Oh, more water over there. <laughs> so, uh, look at this right there the military looking, um, that little plane thing right there. Now it looks like a big boat, a ship or something. Um, wow, now we got see more water. I just let the little go a little bit. Yeah. Kind of make me think of the Causeway Bridge in New Orleans. But I'm glad that it's not that torturous 30 minute, it's over 30 minute, it's like 32 minute ride. And they said 24 miles, the Causeway Bridge, Metairie, Louisiana, that take you to Mandeville. Uh, this one like swamp water. <laughs> marshes and swamps. I remember going to elementary school and learning about the marshes and the swamps. And I've been hearing about how the marshes have been threatened and they would have Christmas trees donated to save the marshes. So they had like a Christmas tree project to help save the marshes and stuff like that um, when I was in high school. I mean, no. Yeah, I was in high school. So, uh, I'm just showing y'all a little tour right here. So, for real, I'm going to go now. I'll see y'all in a while. Bye.